Over in South Dakota, the state's House Education Committee has rejected two bills that would have made changes to K-12 education panels. The two commissions that oversee teacher and school administrators in the state will remain separate. In addition, the state board that sets K-12 education standards will not have additional restrictions regarding who can serve on the board. And in the meantime, the South Dakota Department of Human Services is asking the legislature for more money to maintain staff and increase the number of clients they're able to support at the state's 96 nursing homes and 160 assisted living centers. Officials from the department addressed the Joint Committee of Appropriations to request $715 million for fiscal year 2025. That's a $26 million increase from last year.